Hello guys, welcome back to another video. With the new release of Fab, the Unified Marketplace, and Unreligion 5.5, there has been a ton of confusion on how to actually download MetaHumans now that they have completely removed the Quixel Bridge plugin and have introduced Fab. So if you haven't noticed in Unreligion 5, if you go to the Q plus icon and try to search for the Quixel Bridge window, it's not actually there anymore. And if you go to window, get content, we can no longer open up Quixel Bridge. So default to 5.5, there is no more Quixel Bridge plugin. And instead we have this Fab plugin. So if you open up Fab, there's nowhere to find MetaHumans on Fab. So if I search for MetaHuman, all we're going to find is a bunch of unrelated things. We can't actually find where to download MetaHumans. And if you select on this one, this is actually just these two sample MetaHumans or the sample project for it, we can actually download our custom MetaHumans or the MetaHuman samples that we had previously in Quixel Bridge. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to download MetaHumans inside of Unreal Engine 5.5. And if you guys enjoy this tutorial, make sure that you hit the like button. And also, if you want to learn game development, I have some courses on my website that will teach you how to make different types of multiplayer games like this Steam survival game course. So check it out, link in the description. And without further ado, let's get right into the video. So the first thing that you need to do to actually be able to download MetaHumans is we actually need to download the Quixel Bridge plugin and install it to Unreal Engine 5.5. So currently I'm in a 5.5 project. So you want to open up the Epic Games Launcher and head over to the library tab. And down here you want to scroll all the way down to your vault and in here search for Quixel Bridge. And we should have the Quixel Bridge plugin automatically in your library. And you can see here we can install it to the engine. So you want to click install to engine and you want to select the engine version 5.5 and click install. So that will go ahead and download and install the plugin to Unreal Engine 5.5. And now that we have the plugin installed, you want to go ahead and restart your project. So now that I have reopened my project, I want to go to my edit plugins and search for the bridge plugin. And now you can see that the bridge plugin is enabled. So now we have Quixel Bridge installed on Unreal Engine 5.5. And now basically to download a MetaHuman, it's the same exact process. So you want to go to the Q plus icon and now we can open up Quixel Bridge. There is actually no way to download MetaHumans from Fab at the current moment. Uh, maybe they will change that in the future, but right now you still need to use the Quixel Bridge plugin, which you'll have to install manually on 5.5 because it does not come pre-installed. So now that we are in the Bridge plugin, you can head over to the MetaHumans tab and you can see we now have all of the MetaHumans. We have over you know, 50 plus MetaHumans to pick from. Or if you gone into the MetaHuman creator, you can go to my MetaHumans and you can see you know, MetaHumans that you've created by yourself. They obviously want to come in and log in first. So click on the profile icon and log in to your Epic Games account. And then you'll be able to actually download a MetaHuman. So for example, if I wanted to go to a MetaHuman, say for example, my MetaHuman, you can select the optimization settings and you can download it and just click the add. And once you go ahead and download and add that to your project, you should see a new folder for MetaHumans the name of the MetaHuman, and you can drag in the blueprint or the control rig, whatever you're working this for. As you can see, it has missing plugins. We'll just enable missing plugins, and we should be good to go. So it'll ask you to restart your project. We can go ahead and restart that later, but you guys get the point. That is how you can actually add MetaHumans into your Unreal Engine 5.5 project. You just need to download the Quixel Bridge plugin and install it to that engine because there's currently no way to actually get MetaHumans downloaded from Fab. Now, my guess is they will probably change this in the near future so that under Fab, you'll actually be able to download your MetaHumans from the Fab window, just like you have it in Bridge. They just haven't for some reason gone ahead and updated yet. Unfortunately, Fab has kind of been like a half baked release because it doesn't really have all the features that Quixel Bridge and you know the Unreal Marketplace had. Anyways, that is it for this tutorial. In my next video, I'll be showing you guys the new optimized MetaHumans for Unreal Engine. Basically, you can now download low, medium, or high quality MetaHumans that you can use in your games. So now you can actually have optimized MetaHumans that will be 100 megabytes or less for your project. And you could actually use them in different games, whether you're making a PC game or a mobile game. They're a lot more optimized now for game development. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment down below what you guys think. And that's pretty much it for this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.